ServiceNow ACLs have a field called decision type. And in this video, I'll explain to you what the decision type field is for and how it is used. If we look at an ACL form here, we can see there is this field here, decision type. And decision type has two values, deny unless or allow if. The difference between allow if and deny unless can be a little confusing to understand, but really it comes down to order of operation. A deny unless ACL will run before an allow if. So an allow if ACL says, if someone meets the conditions of the ACL, allow them to have access to the object they're trying to get to. A deny unless says, deny access to the object unless they meet the conditions. So they sound like they would give you the same result. In some respects, they would, except that the important thing to know here is a deny unless ACL will run before an allow if. And if the deny unless ACL fails, then ServiceNow won't evaluate the allow ifs. So you really need to run deny unless with allow if. Simple you know, diagram here. So what we've done here with the deny unless is affected a filtering before the allow ifs happen. So the important things to remember is the order is important, the deny unless runs first, and the deny unless is expecting there to be some allow ifs afterwards for it to check against. So the deny unless is like a filter. Um, as I was saying, the exception is, however, if you have only a deny unless ACL at the field level. So if you have an ACL, which is, let's say, incident dot short description, and it is a deny unless at that level, if you pass the deny unless because you're at the most granular level, ServiceNow will allow access to that object in that case. Um, so that's deny unless. Uh, it's part of, it's all, this is part of the um, ACL matching uh, operation. I've got another video on this, which I'll go through. If you look on the channel or check on the ACL playlist, you will see that where I'll describe the image you can see on the screen here. But what we're just covering off today is the decision type difference between allow with and deny unless. Now, in the videos on the channel, if, you, um, if you've enjoyed them, uh, you found them to be helpful, you might enjoy my teachable course on ACLs. Look in the description and the bio notes. There is a link to my teachable course on ACLs. If you complete that course, you will have mastered all elements of ACLs.